gentlemen, ship owners, operators, masters, and crew, this is a critical call to action regarding upcoming port state control PSC inspections. We're here to equip you with the knowledge and resources to navigate these inspections smoothly and avoid costly detentions and delays. Listen up, because the stakes are high, detentions can cripple your schedule, drain resources, and damage your reputation. Non-compliance with safety regulations puts lives at risk and could lead to hefty fines. But fear not, by taking proactive steps, you can turn the PSC inspection into an opportunity to showcase your commitment to safety and operational excellence. The Paris MOS list of deficiency codes categorizes various issues identified during port state control inspections of ships visiting ports within the memorandums region. These codes help inspectors accurately document deficiencies and track trends in non-compliance with maritime regulations. Here's what you need to know about the Paris MO deficiency codes. The codes are typically formatted as four-digit numbers, for example, 01101. The first two digits indicate the main category of the deficiency, such as number 01, it's related to certificates and documentation. The code 012 indicates the crew certificate and documentation. Knowing the codes can be helpful for ship owners, operators, and crews to understand the following. Common deficiencies identified during PSC inspections. Areas requiring special focus on improvement to ensure compliance. The severity of different types of deficiencies. Inspectors use the codes to record issues found during inspections and assign appropriate follow-up actions, such as rectification before departure or detention of the ship. Here, we're going to explain the overview of deficiencies related to emergency systems. The first item is public address system. According to SOLAS Chapter 3, LSA code it shall be a loudspeaker installation enabling the broadcast of messages into all spaces where crew members, including muster stations able to broadcast from the bridge and necessary places on ship like engine room, steering gear room, also, 
it shall be protected against unauthorized use in interior spaces 75 db and minimum 20 db above the speech interference level in exterior spaces 80 band minimum 15 db above the speech interference level the public address system code this code encompasses a range of deficiencies related to the pa system's functionality maintenance and installation on a ship common deficiencies include inoperable or defective PA system components may include faulty loudspeakers, microphones, or control panels. Inadequate coverage, the PA system may not provide sufficient sound coverage throughout the ship, especially in enclosed or noise-prone areas. Missing or inadequate documentation, proper documentation for the PA system, such as manuals, maintenance records, and calibration certificates, may be missing or incomplete. Unclear or insufficient instructions, the PA system's instructions may be unclear, incomplete, or missing. Failure to comply with SOLAS requirements, the PA system may not meet the requirements of the International Convention for the Safety of Life at Sea SOLAS. Missing, not as required, inoperative, damaged. In additionally to previous items, they must care about the following. Due to the ship crew, washing the bridge deck, and wing also, aft mast, forward mast, he washed then the salt water coming to the mic which led to damages directly. How to preventing this deficiency's regular maintenance, and testing of the PA system are essential to ensure its proper functioning and compliance with safety regulations. This includes inspecting loudspeakers, microphones, and control panels for any damage or defects, conducting periodic sound level tests to verify that the system provides adequate coverage throughout the ship, updating documentation, such as manuals, and maintenance records, regularly, training crew members on how to operate the PA system effectively.